Alrighty then, time for hmm, the final main ending. Time for Makoto. Yeah, that's Makoto. And I'm probably gonna get scarred from seeing him in the vagina. Say what you will. But he changed gingers on me. You can't blame me for freaking out at first. Yeah, and once I finally get back home, I'll probably freak out all over again. I'll probably be like, why you gotta be a dude? Or something. Oh god, I hope not. That sounds so wrong. Kinda like how we dressed him up as a chick for the sports festival. Boy, what a doozy that was. And it really takes me back. Wait, that sports festival, hang on. Kinda think about how did the sports festival end up turning out again? Hold on. Well, whatever. But anyway, she's the one who was the most intimate with me when I first got here. She just came up on to me and treated me like an old friend right off the bat. I remember thinking, yup, this is a Yorori Mikoto I know regardless of chromosomes. And of course, she still doesn't listen to anyone else. She can be a little out there at times, but she still tries to do her best when it really counts. Especially during the evaluation. And now that I think about it, she never once blamed me for getting bitten by the snake. She truly, really is a good person. Truly. So, let's see she would get the voucher. I wonder what she'd use it for. Would be Makoto, she'd probably not even notice a damn thing sitting in the bottom of the box and throw the empty box away. And I'd probably say something, wow, you're really dumb, she'd get all sad. <laughs> so damn predictable. Whatever. For now, let's wrap up this rent a takeru single day voucher up nice and fancy, tie a little bow on top. There, that ought to do it. God only knows who'll end up with this thing. I might very well live to regret this, but it's actually kind of thrilling. Okay. Merry Christmas! It's kind of... Uh, yep, I should have back. Ah. <laughs> oh, I miss. Man, I'm so glad we had the Christmas party. It felt nice to work out. Everyone work hard together to what a common goal. Almost like a culture festival. <laughs> Takes me back. I'm still a little worried about Marie Machana Yuko Sensei, but it seems like everyone really did enjoy themselves. I'm so glad we did this. Hmm? Hey, that's right, my Christmas present. Almost forget about this little guy. Still feel kinda still feel kinda guilty about my shoddy little last minute present, but whatever. Let's see, whose present I get? Hmm? Hey, look at these. Spare type 87 combat boots, sweet. Boots are actually starting to get pretty beat up. I'm genuinely glad I got these. Better try them on. Awesome, they're a perfect fit. Wait, but why? Wasn't this gift exchange supposed to be random? If someone else had ended up with these, they'd have been way too big. But oh well, I guess. They found the way to me, so I guess it's fine. All's well that ends well. Huh? Yeah, it's open. Takeru. Hmm? What's up? Takeru ni watashitai mono ga atte kita. Delivery for me. Kore da. Okay. Are you giving me a voodoo? I assume this one. Taihen desu! Taihen desu yo! What is it? Konna taisetsu na mono moraimasen yo! Would you calm down and tell me what the problem is? This. Hi, Toza. In her own open palm is a handguard from a sword. Isn't this pretty valuable? So you put it to Mokara. Takiru San Yagimas. Me. That's can you with a semester, eh? What is my style? You're so rambunctious. Damn it, May, isn't this thing damn near priceless to you? We should have understood how Gita Shin's works. I should go check up on her. Who's it this time? Oh. Just get in here. Oh, there's only one person screwing me away like this. Get it out already. Oh, so she's got flowers again. Nani,探すこれ。だから何よ。ええ、あなたのだもの。Hmm. Well, those are total crisis situations. I just happened to be in a position to help them out. That's all there was to it, right? It's not like it was some kind of lady killer back in my world or anything. 
私が持っていても使わないからあげる多分そういうものだと思うしそういうことだと思うからタケルさんにあげます白金の宝そなたの譲るその人形の意味がわからぬほど愚かではないあー OK well maybe the presents were for me but I really Really shouldn't be so conceited. I can't possibly, and I'm just being narcissistic. <laughs> nah, I'm totally overthinking this. Oh, I kind of think of it, Makoto never came by, which means she must be the one who got my present. And these boots, they must have been what Makoto chose for me. She doesn't even listen to people at the time, but she can be weirdly thoughtful sometimes. <laughs> Hey, hey. Though, to be fair, she definitely has her ditzy moments. Are still in good shape, otherwise, I'd feel bad taking these. She even checked my size. Well, let's look at these things fit so perfectly. Better go say thank you. She apologized for that stupid scrap of paper. Well, at least it was her. Her, I got it. Not someone who can't take a joke. I'm gonna just go check up on her. Now, where could she have run off to? She's not in her room and she's not in here. So, this is where you were. I was. Doesn't seem too hung up over the present she got. This Mikoto's never been one to sweat the small stuff though. Can I uh, check up on the Fubukis? She's pissed. What's with the cool guy line? You're losing it or what? Is she just not gonna acknowledge my question as per usual? Well, I guess she'll still. or she's still a vast improvement over. Hikoto, in that regard. That guy doesn't listen to a word I say. What, am I bugging you or something? What? Where the hell is this coming from? And how's that supposed to help me learn? How about you explain yourself? Yes, you do. Then I tell you I came or was looking for you. It was like five seconds ago. Yes. Oh, I just wanted to talk to you for a bit. Is now a bad time? So yeah, about those presents we exchanged earlier. But for some reason they all ended up with me. Sword hand guard, a handmade doll. Super duper meal ticket and a potted St. Polly or St. Polly plant. So Ananda. Everyone came up with some vague reason to hand them over to me, or they said, or said they were supposed to be mine. Nara, kito so Ananda yo. What? No, I'm pretty sure they didn't understand how a gift exchange is supposed to work. Honto ni so mo? Huh? Doshite, takiru no tame ni iranda nda te omoanai no? Well, I mean, that's just narcissistic. What's that supposed to mean? もう気がついてるんじゃないの？みんなの気持ち。けどそっか、みんなが竹の所に行ったなら、僕のもちゃんと届いたんだね。Well, not exactly. 
Your boots were the gift I originally ended up with. Well, process of elimination for one boss, I figured that you'd be the one most likely to notice that my old boots are getting worn out. What if they ended up going to someone with a different size feet? No, that's not what I'm getting at. Mikoto? I mean, sure, I was happy, but I was also pretty shocked and kind of confused. What's that supposed to mean? Look, nobody let on that they were going to do anything like this, okay? I'm still a little shocked, that's all. And I also just didn't want to assume that was actually true. I got here a long time after you guys did. And I mean, I try my best to fit in, but... Well, I know I had told you guys back a lot at first. So I figured that maybe this was everyone's way of saying they accepted me as a real member of the crew now. Although, if everyone really did choose their presence with me in mind... And they kind of screwed up, especially since they had no way of knowing if I'd be the one to get them. Huh? What the hell? Why are you getting upset? Who is doofus? Hmm? Seems astute. What's that supposed to mean? それでも誰か別の人のところに行ったならそれは仕方のないことだもんみんなだってそう思って願って選んだんじゃないのかなそれをたけるは迷惑みたいに言うの well, I did say that, I just don't understand it, that's all. What are you trying to say? Well, I mean... Look, I'm sorry. I bet you're pretty disappointed I got that stupid little scrap of paper, huh? Didn't I tell you? All the others stopped by and gave me the presents. You're the only one who didn't. So, anyway, I'm sorry. I just chose my present without even putting, putting any thought into it. So yeah, I get why you're disappointed. Hey, come on, it's nothing we're crying over, is it? Look, I said I'm sorry. I, I do know how you feel, I promise. When I figured out you got my presents, I felt bad about it. Well, yeah, it's not like I didn't consider the possibility that you felt the way you do. I mean, you're right that I avoided thinking about it before you today. I know it probably sounds like a bullshit excuse, but I honestly wasn't in the right frame of mind to even notice. I'm really sorry my carelessness hurt you, or cluelessness hurt you. For what it's worth, I feel like total crap about it myself. And never intended things to turn out like this, I'm, so I'm sorry. Uh, the silence is killing me. And she's staring right through me too. Why do you still look like you're about to cry? Well, guess we'll never know then. Hey, I'm not a miracle worker. Anyway, I'm sorry about all this, and it's been bugging me too, which is why I came here in the first place. Come on, I wouldn't lie to you. Not when it really matters. Yeah, I do. So she stopped looking at the ground all bashful, or so stop looking at the ground all bashfully like that. Fine when we talk normally, but please stop it with the girly reactions. Making it hard for me to even look you in the eye. No, I'm not. That's not it. Stop turning every other... Tuning out every other word I say, dammit. 
OK でもい。いつだって、タケルの言葉はちゃんと聞いてるよ。どんわい。証明してあげようか。お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、お、Okay, why are you even bringing this up now? I don't know why you're doing this. 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 <laughs> Alright, alrighty, you win, it's my fault, whatever, just don't cry. I think I told you this before, but I used to know someone who was a lot like you. So when I see you fidgeting like that, it makes me feel uncomfortable too. No, it's not that. Because I'm seeing you as a woman, duh. Because you're a woman, Mikoto. Do I need to spell it out for you? Oh, I imagine we're about to. I mean, of course I do. You obviously haven't seen your reactions. Oh, to be fair, if you didn't have those cutesy quirks, you could probably pass for a dude. No, seriously, enough of the tears. If I return to my world right now, I wonder how would I react to seeing Makoto as a guy again. Well, give it a couple more seconds, and when you return, you're probably going to be flying a rainbow flag. Would I start in flashbacks to him as a girl? Wouldn't that be, like, wrong? I really don't want to find out. But doesn't that just go to show how much I've accepted this, Makoto? Been like that ever since we were partners on the island. だんだんタケルの体が温かくなっていくのが分かるよ。生きてるからだ。タケル今度は何だタケルの体変なことになってるよ。パパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパパ
Yeah, that's not what I... Are we washing things a little? That's not true. Despite all our training, her skin soft and smooth to the touch. No, I do. <laughs> because if I keep looking at you, I'm gonna lose all self-control. You're the one and only Mikoto, no doubt about it. Hands no longer inside her uniform touch her chest, cheeks, her warm cheeks warm gently. I wrap my arms around Mikoto, holding tight like I never want to let go. Mikoto. Bring my mouth to hers a little more forcefully than I intended. My breath escapes from between our lips, tickling my ears and sending a chill down my spine. No stopping now, okay? Go ahead and end it here, I guess. <laughs> See you guys after the blackout came. I'm sorry, I just couldn't handle trying to talk through that. He's still a boy to me. That girl sure was taking her sweet time. She said she wanted to go back to her room and get changed, but does she fall asleep in there? <laughs> Took you long enough. You look exactly the same as before. <laughs> She really does look like a girl when she holds down her skirt like that. Well, not that I need any more reason to believe she's a girl. Takeru. Sits down next to me and leans on my shoulder. What? <laughs> Come on, don't give me that. <laughs> I'm gonna hug you. <laughs> this must be me happy. And this must be what happening is supposed to feel like. Might actually be pretty alright. Living in this world might not be so bad after all. Mikoto would probably never understand if I told her about it though. Hell, I don't even know if I can ever go back to my own world. There's no real way of knowing if it's possible. Besides, I don't even know if the other world still exists at this point. It might only exist inside of me now. At the very least, I know that this world isn't a dream. Came up with the idea for and planning a Christmas party. And the presence of everyone gave became an opportunity for me to learn their feelings. By coincidence, Mikoto's and mine ended up with each other, and for which became an opportunity for us to make love. Till a few hours ago, I never thought about how Mikoto might feel about me. A lot had happened, but she was just another squad made with her own set of problems. But now, even if I want to go home, it wouldn't be that simple. Not now that I understand my true feelings. Sure, I may have taken a few steps out of order, but I've found my conviction. It was a little pathetic I needed to fall in love before I could find my place here. But hey, I guess things turned out alright in the end. Hmm? Nothing really. No, you'll get mad. I was just thinking back of what a mess you were earlier. Man, I just don't get it. This behavior of yours is just... It's no, not good for me. No, it's just when you act like that, it makes me want to have my way with you. Eh? Don't make me say it again. Don't say that. Don't be stupid. You've always been stupid. Huh? 
Now look who got all confident. All right, that's enough. Telekakushi? <laughs> no. Well, I'll have to tell the others, you know. Well, there's, they're nowhere near as dense as I am. Don't notice whether we tell them or not. I agree. And we'll be less shot to the knee and more pulling out band-aid onto a wound. Not at all. What the hell? Don't you trust me? Want me to? <laughs> Get it now? すれば分かるかも。うん。うん。うん。だけど。207号機を指定収蔵する。はあ。もう全部のよ。だけど心当たりはある? <笑> I don't think we're in trouble. I'll put away all the food and silverware and whatnot. I don't know mind if I handle the rest of the cleanup tomorrow. Kinda think about it when I went to ask Marimo chan about that. She did seem to be acting a little strange. Ne. Hmm? We went to the right place, didn't we? Nah, we'll be fine. I'm right here for you. No, no, we only just got here ourselves. Looks like it's just us for now. Okay, so this is when I can skip. Kagami Sumika Sama. Mada Yumeo Mite Irunoka. Soretomo. これが現実なのか。今でも時々思うことがある。この世界にお前は存在せず、俺の過去を証明してくれるものは何もない。でも、それでも未来はあった。命をかけて守らなければならない。とても危ういものではあるけれども。ゲーム外が突然壊れて動かなくなったあの日、俺の居場所が決まったような気がした。何をどうしてももう二度とお前のいるあの世界を見ることはないのだと確信した。いや。この世界で守るべきもの自分以外の大切なものを見つけたその日から覚悟はしていたことだだから俺はもう二度とお前に会うことはないだろう意味不明でごめん担当直入に書くことにする。驚くかもしれないけど、俺は今この世界で一人の女を愛している。彼女のためなら何でもできる。死ぬことも厭わない。きっとこの覚悟はとてもチンプに聞こえるだろう。お前の世界じゃこの言葉に現実味はないし使い古されてしまった言葉だからきっと現れるでもお前だけは違うんじゃないかそう信じてこれを書いているんだ幼馴染として、ずっとやってきて俺の良いところも、悪いところも、全部わ
お前なら、俺が冗談を言っているのかどうなのか、きっとわかってくれるだろう。むしろ、こんな手紙を書いていることが知れたら、こっちの世界で笑われる。さようなら、すみか。さようなら、父さん、母さん。さようなら、みこと。あとは、いい。別れを言うのは、これだけで、いい。さようなら Rainbow's Chan's handwriting is so pretty, means to read as ever. Thank you, and sorry for asking so much of you. I don't believe it's been two whole years. Part of me feels like it's been shorter than that, but another part of me feels like it's been much longer. We were all commissioned as second lieutenants for the graduating, but our ranks were all that changed. No other students came after us, so we stayed in the same rooms. They haven't even sent us into battle yet. Hmm. I did become squad leader after a while, but it doesn't mean much. Apparently, they need us for alternative five and can't risk us dying too soon. We never ended up getting reassigned either. But here I am with a transfer statement and ID card. With these, I'll be allowed to board the shuttle leaving the space tomorrow. When we take it via an orbiting space station to the migrant fleet gathering at the, Gra the, at the Lagrange point. Turn into five, a plan which prioritizes human survival by immigrating to the Bernard star system and using a massive bombardment of American deuce G bombs to annihilate the beta on Earth. Ever, even after five years of building spacecraft, there's only room for less than 200,000 people on that migrant fleet. Even with only one billion people left on Earth, it's still impossible to save everyone. It took an unfathomable amount of effort just to give a tiny handful of us a chance to escape. After five long years, we're finally going to get a bit more than 100,000 people to safety, but that's all we can do. To this, we humans can't overcome nature, or the Earth, or even ourselves, let alone the Beta. If we seriously wanted to save our species, we could have gotten at least twice that many people up there. You many allowed a handful of people to hold power over the many, and they get to decide who will be saved. I don't know exactly who made this happen or who deserves it most, but at the very least, no way we're all supporting this plan, and most of us are going to be left behind, abandoned by our own kind. The last of the Japanese shuttles leaves tomorrow, and that'll be the last one in the world. As far as I know, the immigrants are all handbricked experts in some field or people with excellent genetic material. I don't know if I qualify as either of those, but someone chose me for some reason. And yet, while I appreciate the sentiment, I have no intention of boarding that shuttle. I used to feel that my own life was the thing I most wanted to protect, but that was a long time ago. There's nothing far more precious now. The silver blossom of a cherry tree that was this brave and loyal soul. Rooting itself firmly in earth and dreams no longer of the sky. I never really want to talk about the words artistic value, but I'm not sure how I feel about being compared to a blossom either. Mm, but as far as I'm concerned, the meaning is what matters. And in that regard, this might just be the greatest poem I've ever read. Thank you so much for letting me do this. Mikoro. Yeah, though it's too bad we can only save a hundred thousand people. Yeah, I guess I did. Yeah, I guess I did. Yeah, I didn't. Don't let your guard down just because it's the last one. I know. Takeru, what happened? I'm not good. Guess I am, yeah. Yeah, yeah, da. Maybe it's because tomorrow is the last day, so I'm feeling a bit sad. No, not really. 
気持ちはわかるよ今の任務が終われば今度は戦場だからね僕たちもミコロ何真面目な顔して Here The other rigid object I've been fiddling with in my pocket Mikado's, Mikoto's eyes open wide when she sees it, sees it in my sweaty hand So it's Yeah. Yeah. She seems as though she's found complete inner peace. She's so happy about my safety that she doesn't even care what might happen to her down here. God, I'm so glad I have you. So you understand, won't you? You understand how I feel and why I'm doing this. This is yours. <laughs> you're gonna be you're gonna board tomorrow's shuttle and set off into deep space. Go to stairs of the card I'm holding out. So do you me? I mean exactly what I said, simple as that. <laughs> you're going to live. I'll protect the shuttle, we all will, and Earth after it. <laughs> Take it. Mikoro. So now, who's that gonna go to you and I do? Book of a son of a no, which it don't want to. Thank you. Nanny more got the night. So any, so no idea what I get another. I've already had the idea rewritten along with the passenger list. I was left for you to get on board. Jingu, she shows a top chook to got the other note. Called it up under me. Not just Marie Machan, everyone in the squad feels this way. That's right, I've talked with all of them about this. And that's why. Because I knew you'd kick up a fuss about it like you're doing right now. I don't want to order you to do this, Mikoto. Mikoro. I'm not gonna do that. Because you're more important to me than anything, Mikoro. だけど、その気持ちがあるなら、僕の気持ちもわかるでしょ。タケルは僕にとって大切な人なんだ。その人のためになら戦える。だから、Makoto, get on that shuttle, leave the planet. That's an order. タケル! That's an order. その命令は聞けません。Second Lieutenant Yoroi. 聞けません。Second Lieutenant. Second Lieutenant Yoroi, state your orders. こんな時に上官権限なんか必要だよ。やめてよ。僕はね、死ぬのは怖くないよ。みんなのために。やるべきことを果たすだけだよ。地球を旅立つ人たちに、すべてを託しているから、その人たちが。人類の未来を切り開いてくれるって信じているからそれがタケルのためならどれだけ幸せなことかだからタケルが生きて本当はタケルと離れるのは嫌だよ Mikoto, listen. I'm no different. I can't stand on having you here with me. But you can't always run away from the pain. Because we can't save everyone, and I want you to take my place. If you saw, if you stay on Earth, you're just waiting to die. I can't stand the idea of you having such a predetermined fate. 
Can't you prepare yourself to live instead? Takebu. I'm afraid of dying and of losing you, Mikoto. ミコロ。タケルがいないところに行くなんて。いつでも散る覚悟はできてたのに。いつの間にか怖くなってたんだ。I たとえ離れてもタケルが生きていれば僕は戦えるよお願いだよタケル明日駆逐艦に乗ってはい Really, not like you're gonna do as I say. Takeru, wakatte kureru no? Yeah. Takeru. Which means I won't be needing this anymore. Eh?ちょ、ちょっと何やってるんだよ、Takeru。それは大事だ。Sorry, Marie Mochana. I know how hard you worked to arrange this for me. It's not fair. You're the only one who gets what they want. Don't you agree? Okay, I'm fine with this. Remember you wishing for something else earlier. Let's compromise with that. Didn't you say that you didn't want us to get separated? Same goes for me. I don't want to leave you either. Let's stick together until the end. Okay? I tossed the broken ID card over the garbage can. Those ads bounced off the rim and landed on the floor. Could have followed it with her eyes the whole time. Don't hesitate now, you're gonna make me regret failing to persuade you. That's alright. Could have falls into my chest and I wrap my arms gently around her. Stop apologizing and don't start crying at me. <laughs> I need you to keep on smiling. <laughs> Mikoto, we'll be together now and always. Kuchikukan <laughs> あと三十分だね。いや。最後の打ち上げだ。何事もなく終わってくれればよいが。終わりよければなんとやら。うん、そうだね。さ、そろそろ準備しましょう。その後もいろいろやることがあるんでしょ。ましゅ。Wait、h
Sorry, everyone, and thank you. Takeru! Mikoto, what's wrong? Calm down. Kasumi's room? Well, I mean, yeah, I know. What's the problem? You didn't tell me the way what? What do you mean? Isn't she always in the same place? It's in the restricted area, on floor B99. Well, anyone with an S-World book ID should be able to get in, but... But since I had my ID made off of the books, I saw I could keep going there even after things went south. Kazumi's position was supposed to be one of Alternative 4's best kept secrets. And all the other Alternative Program staff have already boarded. Which means... We'll do. Class, wrap your acting commander while I'm gone. Hurry. Alright, let's do this. Mukasumi, I guess this is a goodbye. You take care of yourself, alright? Make sure you eat your carrots up there. Hi. Till next time. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Alright, how long until launch? Okay, everyone but Zakaki get to your positions. Don't get careless now, this is the last one. Yokai! <laughs>夢を見た。命を何かができたんじゃないかと思う。この世界に俺が来た意味はそこにあったんじゃないかと思う。悲しい別れも だから
その力があるはずだ人類は負けない絶対に負けない俺がいるから俺がいるから生ウェイ。
Time for the other one. Mikoto. <gasps> Pull our bodies close together and squeeze each other tight. She's so soft and warm, and this is Mikoto's scent. All of this which I'm holding in my arms, this is all Mikoto. This weight on my chest is Mikoto. This heart beat is Mikoto's. Mikoto. I don't like this, I don't want to leave you either. Before I know it, I'm squeezing her tighter. But... Even that means I have to let go. In the very least, I want you to live for the both of us. I need you to live. I want you to want to leave behind some sort of proof that I was here in this world. You're the only one who can do that, Mikoto. It takes as much courage to live as it does to die, and I want you to live. Sorry, I know what I'm saying is cruel. But since we can't save everyone, at the very least I want you to live on. Mikoro. I'm so sorry. Thank you, Makoto. Makoto <laughs> nods over and over and over in my chest. If, all, well, if only it were possible, I want us to always be together. I don't want to leave you either. The softness, this warmth, the scent, this frame, this weight, this heartbeat. I know how you feel. You know I'd keep you in my, by my side forever if I could. Mikoto. Ready yet? You're definitely the lightest packer I know. Here, I'll carry your bag. Arigato. Who the hell packs this light for an intergalactic voyage? まあ、なんとかなるよ。ねえねえ。うん。さっき部屋に何しに行ったの？すぐ戻るって言ったくせに全然戻ってこないんだもん。yeah, sorry, I was just writing a letter. Some old friends and loved ones not thought I'll ever reach them. After we see you off, we'll finally start the counter of Minsa to Bateka Asia, you know. Nah, it's not a will. I'm not sure what to call it, but if anything, it's the exact opposite. Let her to make sure I come home alive. Wrote some pretty wimpy stuff in there, so I've got to go out there and kick some beta ass and hurry home so I can rip that thing to shreds. Well, that's the plan anyway. <laughs> hey, come on, that's not true, is it? So? Well, I wouldn't say I'm good at it, but I don't suck. So ka.まだまだ僕の知らないタケルがいっぱいそうだね。これからたくさん知っていけるはずだったのに。Sly little mess. Mikoro. Go, go, me. Me, toka. So not so much. Yeah, I know, but hey, there's plenty of stuff I don't know about you either. So, kana. Buku a zenbu takiru ni misetiru yo. Well, you sure didn't hold back, that's for sure. I guess it's not in your nature. Ah, nanka hidoi koto itteru. You got way too close for comfort with me when we first met, remember? You behave yourself on that spaceship. Good. And also trying to 
trying to make sure no one mistakes you for a guy. Eh? It's eerily possible, you know. Yeah, that's what I mean. Do you have to take every single opportunity to stick your chest out? And it's not like they're that much bigger anyway. That's right, you owe me. You gotta be kidding me. You're gonna make every, anyone who mistakes you for a guy feel you up. You dumbass. <laughs> Uh, knowing you, I guess I didn't have to be worried about. Well, I don't have much to be worried about. Yeah. Your adaptability has always been your greatest strength, after all. Mm. Yep, you're always so optimistic and happy just to be lying. Try to keep it that way. I won't, I promise. Now come on, let's go. Everyone's waiting in the PX. You're running away with our hopes and dreams. Yeah, and our legacy. You're not alone. At least not in spirit. Don't say that. I mean, I tried to convince one of them to go up first, remember? Call them out one by one to see if they go. Mm. You know what? They all said that if I wasn't going, I should make you go. Unless like they talked to the beforehand. They all got upset with me. Mina. They all warned me not to tell you until the very last day. Guess they really do know you best. Mina. <laughs> huh? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where the hell is everyone? Are? What the hell, guys? If this is a prank, I'm not laughing. That's not it. Everyone's just hiding somewhere. Come on out, guys. Come on out, Nida guys. Choke's over. Uh-huh. I'm telling you, that's not it. Tomo, where the hell's everyone? Yeah, what the hell's going on? Where is everyone? Wait, what? What'd you say? She's probably in that room. Kasumi's possession was supposed to be one of Alternative 4's best kept secrets, and all the other Alternative program staff have already boarded. Which means, I'm the only one who can get there. Only my ID and retinal pattern can gain access to that floor. <sighs> Alright, I'll handle it. In the meantime, get everyone else back in here. <laughs> no. It's on floor B19F. You need S4 level clearance you guys can't get in. S4 level? Now's not the time to talk about it. You just make sure everyone you can get everyone here. This will be the last chance to say goodbye. けど、いいんだよ、ミキさん。だ、だけど、これでお別れになっちゃうかもしれないよ。打ち上げの時間が。それでいいんだ。よろいさん、たけるってさ、その時その場で何が大切なのかよくわかってる人だよね。うん。そうだけど。駆逐艦が落ちてきた日、不安に押しつぶされそうになっていたミキさんを、タケルが探しに行った時と同じだよ。この人はそういう人なんだ。うん。だからミキさんも、この人、この人のこと。Him and Tama, you knew you could just use your radio. So why are you going to find them in person? 
You don't need to be so damn considerate of us. Hora, boke to shite chata dame da yo. Right. Ato 15 fun kurai nara koko ni irareru kara. Mikoro. Dakara. Oakare no aisatsu wa totte oku yo. All right. Sa, hayaku Kasumi san o tsurete itte agete. I'll be right back. Um. Itte rashai. Yashiro! Koko kara wa watashi ga gekishin ga sugu derareru kara. Alright, I'm coming. I'm counting on you. Well, Kasumi, I guess this is goodbye. Take care of yourself, alright? Make sure you eat your carrots up there. Bye. Bye. Bye bye. Takeru. Alright, where's Mikoto? Mikoto. ごろ。25分経った。待つように言ったのだがな。約束は約束だって。時間通りに行っちゃった。あ、せい。あ、激震で追いかければまだ。No, as long as she left with a smile on her face. That's all that matters. Takeru! Don't worry. We still put any goodbyes anymore when we start having second thoughts. Do you guys all remember her smile? なんだかどこかに旅行に行くような感じだったよね。あ、自然で気軽でいつもの笑顔であった。鎧は強いね。Yes, she is. Thanks, you guys. <laughs> now, let's get going. It's almost that time. You okay? You may have a dream. 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 命を危険にさらしながら守るべきもののために生きる人々の夢を夢と現実の境界は目覚めた時に見えたものをどう感じるかだけだそれを区別できるのは神様だけなんだろうだけど俺には何かができたんじゃないかと思うこの世界に俺が来た意味はそこにあったんじゃないかと思うこれが避けられぬ運命だったのならこの世界で俺という存在は何だったのか悲しい別れも人類の運命もそして自分の運命も俺には変えられたんじゃないかと思う守るべきものを本当に守りたいという強い意志が最初からあったなら俺には誰にもできないことができたのかもしれないそう思うだからだからせめてこれから生きて生き延びてすべてを守ろうと思う誰もが諦めたこの星を守り抜きたいそう思う残された人々を残された思い出をそして愛する人を命をかけて守る俺は何かができるはずだその力があるはずだ人類は負けない絶対に負けない俺がいるから
俺がいるから。
わかるかなうんわかるよここからじゃ見えないけどあのすぐ近くにね地球っていう星があるの地球うんそうだよこの星でみんなが幸せに暮らしていけるのはパパたちが地球で頑張ってくれているからなんだよ<笑>パパいつ帰ってくるのうーんそうだな君がもっと大きくなってからかなパパそれまで頑張ってるのうん君やママみんなのためにずっとずーっと頑張ってくれてるんだよパパ頑張って<笑>パパ頑張って<笑>ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ But I've been told about it. I'll see you guys for that one. It might be a bad end, I don't know. We'll see when we come to it. But for now, peace, guys.